Welcome to this first matchup of Sunday Rumble number 23. Casting with me today is 4th Oracle. 4th? Hello. We're getting into Canyon Ambush here. 4th, quickly tell us about this map before we do loadouts. Canyon Ambush is kind of interesting, both on the north and south spawns. You have this nice big open area, easy to snipe through, but as soon as you get into the center of the map, it becomes an absolute brawl fest. All right, let's go over our ship loadouts here. The first one for the Arcane Bolt. This is a Glowwater Thralls versus Cake matchup. Chief Navigator Craftic Sturdy is our first pilot for today, piloting the Arcane Bolt. We have on it a double whirlwind at the lower deck. Those things can shred hulls instantly. We also have double Artemis on the main deck, and the top deck has a double barrel mortar. Second ship, the Masso. I don't, I'm not sure how to pronounce that, to be honest, but that's Fiasco Total Ship. We have on the front a Gap Mortar, and on the side we have Flamethrower and a Banshee. Go ahead, Oracle. And aboard the VSS Carrot Cake, we have Captain Sir Morty with a carronade on the front, flamethrower on the starboard side, and a double barrel mortar on the uh, port. Morty is... That's really odd. Morty is a gunner. Xander Broda Oops. is disconnected. Oh, dear. Oopsie uh, daisy. Trying to turn back on chat there. Uh, they haven't said anything, so they haven't... Okay, no, Bellana just saw that. We may. I'm not sure what's going on here. Uh, let's continue with loadouts, though, on uh, the four ship here. Yep, Fozzy the Pira getting dunked in the face right now, dropping hard, not even going to be able to see what he has. That Ouch. real quick kill from the Arcane Bolt. Oh, my goodness. Whew. Well, we, at least we saw him blow up. I, I'm yes, not sure how to spin yeah. that positively. Xander Broda just rejoined. Why not? Getting shredded by the whirlwinds. Those Gonna whirlwinds. Nasty bump. He's got three Gatlings on him. There goes the armor. Look at he those Gatlings just... shred that hull. Now, they're not doing a lot of permahull damage right now, but good lord, they are destroying the outer hull. Masu putting a lot of pressure right now on the carrot cake, pressing him backwards outside this rock wall just against it. Outer hull going down on the carrot cake, not quite puncturing that permahull permanently, though. It's not over yet for the carrot cake, but it's getting really close. Arcane Bolt is coming back with those Gatlings. That's it. Ouch. Yep. Now the Fozzy of the Pira is in a nasty spot. Arcane Bolt and Masu are going to try and charge him, I think. Spawn's going to come pretty quick for the Goldfish, but are they I able think to this take charge, out the of the Pira? I think this charge might actually be a bad idea. Fozzy of the Pira has some really great mid-range weapons, and Masu oh. just cannot close that range. Its outer hull is actually... It's going down, it looks like. It may, its outer hull may go down. Yeah, the carrot cake spawns in, but it takes a moment for everyone to get on their positions. And now he's coming in, gonna light the arcane bolt on fire just a little bit. The armor just keeps going down on Fozzy. And I think he's gonna be able to get out of this. That balloon pop on the arcane bolt was strong. Oh, the bump. Fozzy, is Fozzy stuck there right now? Is uh, he... I think he can get out. Oh, maybe not. This isn't good. <laughs> Not That's only more than half of his perma hull yeah, just from that bump. He is continuously destroying himself on this pipe, trying to get off of it. It looks like that little, that little, those little, those little fins on the bottom of the pyramidian kept getting caught. Carrot cake getting destroyed by that double gat mortar combination, as well as support from the masso. 3-0 in favor of Glowwater Thralls very quickly. This is not a normal canyon ambush map. Very up close, very dirty. No, absolutely. Now Fozzie the Pira is in trouble. Too close to get that Hades burst off, and the Arcane Bolt is going to be able to just sort of throw some gats in the face of the Fozzie. Armor's going to go down nice and quick. Here comes the Mortar. That's it. From all Fozzie. the damage, and there it goes. Fozzie's ouch. Brutal. 4-0 in favor of Cake. This is a meat grind scenario, ladies and gentlemen. Very, uh, very unfortunate for the Cake folks. Glowwater Thralls, however, amazing pressure from them. They have been able to really lay it on thick, taking down yeah, Cake Ship after Cake Ship after Cake Ship. Glowwater Thralls, though, I mean, it's not really fair. It's a 3v2. They have uh, the they have the Masu, the Arcane Bolt, and that Pipe coming in at the last second. That that's uh, so. true. Great teamwork by all three yeah. all three Glowwater Thrall ships. 
Yeah, very, very nice. Masu gonna rise up a little bit. Armor goes down. Mortar is gonna be coming in any second. I think they're just camping the hull. Uh, no, it's just Johnny Cyanide, oddly enough. Lana's running back up. Lana the hull! But I don't think it's gonna be enough. Care Cake flies Maybe over the will. top of the Arcane Bolt. Great move by the Carrot Cake, going exactly where that Mobula could not lift or drop itself towards. Straight above, over, and past. But pressure from the Masso is taking on the Carrot Cake. Mortars are going out. Not perfectly well timed, though, with when that Gat broke the Outer Hull. Outer Hull is stripped once again on the Carrot Cake. Mortars are late. Very late. Still, though, that carrot cake is almost down, and it's still on the bad side of that Pira. There we go. I'm actually I'm shocked. Cleaning this up. I'm shocked nicely. that uh, they lived that long. I really am. Yeah. I mean, the goldfish has such an easy to repair hull. Six mm -hmm. wax with the spanner. That's Absolutely. nothing. Absolutely. All right, that is the first game of this best of three here on Sunday Rumble number twenty-three: Glowwater Thralls versus Cake. Join us for the next one right here on YouTube.com slash The Robin Dan Show.